Hi, welcome to another DIY. Here I'm using an old mop bucket to make an ottoman. Here I made a quarter size template and transferring it into a large size cardboard. The size is 50 by 60 in width and length. I made a total of six of the same shape. I'm gluing the cardboard together using hot glue. You can even use paper glue. I think it goes well with cardboard. To attach the cardboard to the bucket, I'm using Gorilla Heavy Duty Glue. It actually shows it goes with everything, ultra high strength, hold instantly when born under water, indoor and outdoor. I'm using a generous amount of glue. I place some weight on top and let it dry completely. In the meantime, I made few cardboard rolls with wooden doubles inside. It is of the same height as the mop bucket. At first, I used four rolls with doubles inside into the pressure points on four sides and all the other rolls are just cardboard only in this part i'm using some flexible cardboard sheets because it's easy to glue on following the shape. sticky tape so it will give an extra strength over the glue just in case then I cut out a smaller shaped template and uh, transfer the shape into the center part I'm using four-way stretchy crushed velvet fabric strips of drawing sheet. I'm using it as a tacking strip, gluing it into the seam of the fabric and once we use it, it will give a nice and clean appearance. Now you can see why I'm using the paper strips inside. 
It will give a neat and clean appearance while we glue it on to the edge part. To cover the bottom part, I just glued on some upholstery lining material. I'm transferring the shape, smaller cardboard shape, into the foam. You can actually make it with or without foam. It is a satin silk fabric. Then I used some fiber in the center, covered it with foam, followed by the fabric. This part is specially for the purpose of decoration. And if you want to make it for sitting or use it as a coffee table, please watch the rest of the video. As a coffee table, you can cover the cardboard shape with fabric and glue it into the center part. I'm gluing on a bead string to get a detailed appearance. To use it as a decorative ottoman, we can glue on the cushion into the center part. To use it as a seat, you can use a regular cushion cover and sew on tassels into four corners and form inside. And that's the end of the video. Hope you all enjoyed the DIY. See you soon with another craft. Bye.